Hello, hello, I'm here. Honestly, I'm ready to get started, like, right now, so that I can do this terrible TV post- TV puzzle. We did the red section yesterday. I kind of hate this. <laughs> I hate this so much. Let's get started. And the green. Okay. No, what that. Okay. Do do. Okay, this third one. This is the third one. No, it's the second one. Okay. Okay. And then this inner one. Oh, there we go, we did it. <laughs> That's the green one done. We might actually get this done really quickly. I should have downloaded Shadow's Edge. I should, I should have been ahead of the game. I knew this would happen. Okay, unless I spend about 50 minutes trying to do this blue one now. Reds at the top. Blue. These all need to be there. Mm. Oh, that was an accident. <laughs> the footage from Frosty's camera. I'm sure of it. It did record after all. He's a little sneak. I knew it. I think it's a lost cause, Nancy. It's permanently broke. Bummer. Well, at least I managed to get some dirt on Frosty. Oh, is this his camera? What, Moomin? I just fed you before the stream so that you wouldn't moan at me. Why? What could you possibly want now? You're so cute. Let, let me stroke you, you mean cat. She's so mean. She literally just came in to yell at me and then wouldn't even let me stroke her. But I fixed it. It recorded the audio. Did that. That's done. Check. Okay, let's do this. I need to let these mice go before they starve or something. Oh, do I still have mice? Are they pause mice? <laughs> I think that's still where we want to go. Okay. Move. Nancy's the best driver. That 
wasn't there before. What the heck is that? The mining rod that's missing from the museum. I oh, this. Trying to hide it. And stepped in that pool of oil over there in the process. Well, we'll take that back to Pa. Pa! I've got something for you, Pa! Okay, if that's that, then isn't Pa's here? Ah, I don't know if I'm going the right way. I'm looking for Pa's. Ah! Ah! Sorry. Pa, I found your divining rod. Do you want it back? Beautiful. <gasps> Hi, Lies! You only played this one once. I... I pl I hated this one the first time I played it, but I don't hate it this time. I hated that TV puzzle, and I hate blood in blood in Scott and Frosty. But overall, I am I'm, I'm having fun. What can I do for you, little lady? How are you? Happy Friday. You'll be happy to know I not only found your missing divining rod, but I put it back in the display. Well, put the cat out of the rain. Where was it? Out in the spring house. I appreciate you putting it back like that. That was real nice of you. You know, a good deed like that deserves a good reward. Also, like, I've heard that the new Nancy Drew game is not going to be available on Steam on the release day, only from the Her Interactive website. And the Her Interactive website only allows you to um, download the game once. So if you ever like uninstall it, you have to buy the game again. Uh, so uh, I think I'll be waiting for Steam. Actually, to be honest. Thanks, Pa. I've enjoyed talking to you. Don't let them canoes work you too hard. Maybe it's after playing some of the other games. This one doesn't seem so bad. <laughs> it's not one of the best, for sure, but it's not as bad as I remember finding it. Yeah, apparently. So I don't think I'll be partaking in those business practices, to be honest. I want to own it on Steam, where all the rest are. I want to reserve the right to, you know, rage uninstall it <laughs> when I can't do a puzzle. But I do want to play it before, like, any guide or anything comes out. Because so I want to give it a shot at, like, solving a Nancy Drew game when you, l with, like, no clues available. <laughs> but apparently, yeah, apparently that's what they're doing, and it's because. Well, the rumour is that it's because um, Midnight in Salem released on Steam and got so many negative reviews, it got, like, obliterated. What's up? Also, probably they want to keep more of the money. A big pile of dumb. I've heard there is a way to save these. Yeah, yeah, you have to... Um, you have to install it on like a you have to keep the installation on a external hard drive but you shouldn't have to do that <laughs> um yeah just keep it installed i wonder how big it is just never delete the installer A 
Everything go okay on that chase I had to miss? Yep, the sky was incredible. Saw a couple of promising wall clouds, but nothing ever dropped. Feel free to take a look at the pictures I just downloaded. They are awesome! Thanks for all the advice. See ya! Are these the five toes? That's nice. That's pretty cool. Wow, look at that. Not gonna be a physical copy. Oh no! Was there a physical copy of Midnight in Salem? <laughs> Honestly, that they, they this game determines the future of Nancy Drew. Oh my gosh, why is my stream buckling? Oh my goodness. Why why are we struggling here? Why? Let's um Let's just check nothing's updating. Because I've been burnt before by automatic updates. Do, 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 do. No, I have no idea. Oh, I should probably save it. Because I did the stupid TV puzzle. No idea why the stream's struggling so much. We'll wait it out. <laughs> we sit and twiddle thumbs. Let's get let's get more tea. Wait, when do I, how long do I have? What, April, May, June, July, August? Oh no, I need to get a wriggle on. <laughs> I started a, a writing course last year and I am, um, it's meant to be a year long. I think I have like four months to do the majority of it. <laughs> uh, okay, we'll do that. I'll do that at some point. Yeah, I've only done three out of ten modules. <laughs> oh dear. What a silly goose I am. Oh yeah, I'm not playing <laughs> Midnight in Salem again. I really want this one to be good. I really need this one to be good because I just don't, I don't want to come off as somebody who just is going to hate the new games. It's just not, I'm not about that. I, I just didn't like Midnight in Salem. Not because it's new. I just hated it. Please don't make me a old game purist. Her interactive... It does look promising though, it looks like there's- I mean in the trailer there was already more puzzles than in Midnight in Salem, so... Okay, we're back in the green, according to my... Okay. Oh my god, why is my screen brightness on? My friend messaging me because of Taylor Swift's new album. It's a day. It's an exciting day for Taylor Swift fans. How long? Oh, in, it's le in, in less than two months I'll, I'll be at a concert. How exciting. Do, 
do, do, do. Right, what am I supposed to do now? Tell Debbie? Check. Something? I don't, I don't think, I think I'd have to have some serious memory loss <laughs> to play Midnight Salem again. I, I, I put, upload all my VODs of me playing the Nancy Drew games to YouTube just because I like them. I like my streams and stuff, so I upload them. I have not uploaded the Midnight in Salem ones. I'm just miserable. I'm just, I'm honestly shocked anybody watched me play that because I just came off like a big cow bag. I came off so badly, I think, just because I was like, I, I'm not having a good time. <laughs> What's up? I'm almost positive the footage on that tornado that hit the barn I just saw on TV is footage that Frosty shot. That's impossible. For one thing, his camera wasn't working. It was bloody working i'm sick of everybody in this game gaslighting me about this camera it was working debbie i fixed it <laughs> honestly i get more upset about the way people tra treat nancy than nancy does yeah but it was i fixed it i know it somebody with a camera must have stopped nearby and in all the excitement you just didn't see them look nobody likes to admit they screwed up okay but you screwed up. It happens to everyone. So just admit it and move on. I, I'm not having this, Debbie. You're all going down. That's I'm messaging Krollmeister right Have now. Fun. Withdraw the funding, Krollmeister. They're all idiots. I'm gonna fight. I'm pretty. Hello, Nancy. Do I have to confront him about I Brooke? I heard someone talking about some Brooke person. Who is she again? Brooke Tavanaugh. She heads the chase team that in all likelihood is going to whoop our collective fanny in the competition. Does she deserve to win? I don't know. Look, if it's all the same to you, I'd just as soon talk about something else, okay? Why don't you Let's get talk a about cat cats. for your mice problem? Cats? Forget about it. I'm deathly allergic to cats. Mice are annoying, but at least they don't leave me sneezing and short of breath. I'll let you get back to work. Don't hurry back. I hate you all. What about Chase? Hey there. How was the chase that I missed? Oh, it went pretty good. Didn't see any funnel clouds, but I managed to plant a sensor right in the path of a major downdraft, if you can believe that. Was Scott there to see it? He went in the base vehicle by himself. But he was real happy when he heard about that sensor, yes ma'am. You've been spending all your spare time around here trying to find oil, haven't you? What? Oil? Why well, I've been doing no uh, such thing. Where'd you get an idea like that? Your boots and pa. I found the divining rod you took from Pa's museum. The one you left by the old spring house. I should have known I wouldn't get away with it. Lying and conniving and sneaking around, they just don't come natural to me. My mama raised me just too right. See, I heard rumors there was an oil deposit somewhere underneath this here farm. I also heard the college was getting ready to dump the place, so I signed up with Scott, figuring I could look for oil. And if I found some, try to get my daddy to invest in a little real estate. Did you really think you could find oil using an oversized stick? It ain't no stick. It's a divining rod. The one I took from Paul's isn't just any divining rod, neither. Used to belong to Charles Hamilton. It's that stick that made him the richest man in the state. My great granddaddy saw it in action once. Well, so why did you have to steal it? <laughs> you could just make one. Like it was being held there by <laughs> Sun's in my eyes. Oh, yeah. The men started digging, and sure enough, they hid oil. And I found oil around here, too, a couple of times. Of course, when I started digging, all I ended up with were puddles. But that's because of Scott. He's the one messing stuff up around here. He's a jinx. And that's the truth. Listen, I'm he is the worst. Wait, no, Frosty is the worst. I will apologize to Pa for taking that divine rod first chance I get. And I know it's highly unlikely, but should you and my mama ever cross paths? I'll keep this to myself, but <laughs> you've got to keep being honest with me. Don't tell my you mom. <laughs> you know, come to think of it, I guess I can't rightly say all the bad stuff that's been going on is just bad luck. 
Like when I checked out the lightning rod on the farmhouse to see why Scott's phone blew up like that? I discovered something kind of strange. Instead of being wired so any lightning that struck the house would be directed to the ground, this here lightning rod connected to the wire inside the house. Someone wanted that phone jack to explode? Yeah, are they trying to set a fire? Someone just wanted to do some damage. But you're sure it was wired that way on purpose? Either that or this thing was put up by the world's dumbest electrician. I'll check back with you later. See you around. I've also been playing, well, I re, well, what's the right word? I picked up my save from Starfield again. Because the, I didn't do the Crimson Fleet mission. So I wanted to do that. Um, I've just been doing like the side missions I didn't do. It was easier to pick up than I thought it was going to be. I thought I was going to get start getting really frustrated with like the the ship flying, but I just went straight in there and was winning all these space fights. So that's nice. Debbie, someone's trying What's to set up? us on fire. I better get to Debbie work. doesn't care. Have okay. fun. All right, what do I do? I'm, I've done everything. Can I go home? Maybe I should go to bed. Well, well, am I allowed? Do I have to wait until Debbie says? It's too soon to go to bed. Yeah, I have to wait until Debbie says I'm allowed to go to bed. Okay, I guess we'll call someone. Hardy boys? Please tell me you're going to get right up in the middle of things. Frank and I just saw footage from last year's EF3 in Kansas on the internet and... And we think that you should be very careful out there and shouldn't do anything reckless. Unless you're with Frosty. He's the best. No, you he's not. Frosty? Of course, he's only the most fearless shooter on the He's the worst. Today. Everyone's seen that one picture he took. The one with the grapefruit-sized hail flying right at the lens. You know what I'm talking about. You sure you're talking about Should've the same him. Frosty here? The one with a high-pitched scream? High-pitched screaming aside, it takes a lot of bravery to shoot out in the field. One man's bravery is another's reckless stupidity. Half dozen six situations aside, I... You should definitely keep an eye on him. Awesome photographer or not, something's not on the up and up. Yeah, he's the worst. Mind. That's what. Oh, also, tomorrow I'm going to go play mini-golf. It's T-Rex themed. <laughs> I can't wait. I hope the weather's nice. I booked it because the weather was like starting to get really nice here and then it's taken a turn for the worst and it's zero degrees again. <laughs> so let's, let's just hope. Spring is really springing this year. Hmm. Do I have to take pictures of all the clouds? What? <laughs> I'm supposed to be taking pictures of clouds? I can't May get pictures of all the clouds that I need. Don't forget that weather is always changing. The cloud formation you need could form anywhere. If you're having trouble finding a formation, you don't necessarily need to chase it down. Just keep an eye out. Okay, talk to you later. That's what we're here for. Wait, I'm supposed to be taking pictures of clouds. You've turned into summer. No, yeah, so that's why I got like overly confident. The past couple of years, spring has been completely skipped. It's just gone from, you know, cold to warm. But no, we've got some spring. It was like 17 degrees Celsius last week, and then last night it was zero. I, I'd already got rid of my winter blanket, and I had my summer blanket. <laughs> it was cold. I guess we just go look for clouds then? Are they on the GPS? Can I go here? I'm a bit mad. I don't want to look for clouds. I 
don't want to look for clouds. Mm, maybe I'm starting to remember that I, why I hate this game. <laughs> maybe I didn't like the cloud searching. That seems like something I would hate. Oh my gosh! I've been bullied off the road! Please don't hit me. Excuse me, I'm trying to get in here. Okay, we've already taken this. Oh wait, don't they change, like, often? I'm getting angry at this driving. I'm just gonna take pictures. That's that's those are clouds. Right, more clouds. Where? Over here. Where's the nice music? I can't turn around. <laughs> Why? I swear it didn't used to be like this. There, there, no, there. Move me out of the way, thank you, thank you. I've been saved, my hero, my hero. Okay. Ah, I can't. Sorry, I'm not used to this side of the road. <laughs> I'm not used to this side of the road. <laughs> It's actually a real issue for me in like GTA as well. I'm, I'm not so bad at driving in GTA on the right side, but I always get in the car on the wrong side of the road. Like always. <laughs> oh no. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna go all that way without crashing. Let's go in here. Autumn has stayed a summer. How hot is that, Pogo?
That's where I got stuck last time. Oh no. Oh no. Good time of day, Pogo. Good time of day. G'day, Pogo. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Mid twenties. It's a no from me. Okay, if we haven't got all the pictures of clouds we need by now, we riot. We riot at dawn, first things first. First things first, we complain. Hmm, that's pretty. Second, we pull up a guide. <laughs> Trail of the Twister guide. <laughs> cloud guide. I, I only want the clouds. Okay, sometimes when we were going in and oh no, we're stuck again. Okay, when we were going in and out, I would like to go back in, please. Going in and out changed the clouds, so I want to do that again. But we're gonna have to wait <laughs> until. There we go. I don't know if it's me. It's me. Hi, I'm the problem. It's me. But this does not seem good. Help me, car. <laughs> well, that's good. Thanks. Thanks for that. Thank you very much. Hey, it's not me, it's driving on that side of the road and also the other drivers. Hi, serotonin bear. <laughs> I'm trying to, I didn't realize I actually had to take pictures of the clouds. And so this, this is kind of a, a horrific re revelation, to be honest because I, I I'm not really interested in clouds I can't I can't lie let's have a look let's pull up a guide so we know we're getting the right clouds oh wow there's a walkthrough PDF <laughs> I will not be having that PDF Cloud. Mm -hmm. Okay. I've got a guide up so we, we don't have to worry anymore. But I'm still just going to take pictures of everything. Ooh! Ooh! That looks good.
it's amazing how fast the weather changes. Right, so what's what's this? This is Grace Mount. Okay, now we need to go to Bluebird Lane. Where's that? Okay, we went there. But I'm not sure if I actually took any good pictures. So let's go again. Is this it? Okay. Uh, no, it looks, it looks pretty cloudless. This is it. This is the goods. N N six two zero. Where's that? Is that like this? Thank you, Pogo. I appreciate it. And also not enjoying driving on that side of the road. It's just natural to me. Oh my god. What is it? Oh no. Oh, well, how did I end up here? This is not where I wanted to be. Ah! Uh, help! <laughs> Help! I'm being bullied. Help! Help! <laughs> I'm just gonna crash. No. My god! <laughs> we were never gonna make it. Okay. Imagine if you just press no. No, I think I'm done. <laughs> I think I'm done for forever. Which is funny because I was just telling Light that I was enjoying this game. Wrong way, wrong way. Turn around. Hit this way. Ah! I keep getting stuck. This is a perfectly... No, don't come this way. Don't come this way. <laughs> okay. Wait, is this where it's said to go? Lark Lane. We've been to Lark Lane. Oh no, we want to go here. I I only seem to with this top down. Like I was just saying, in GTA, I drive on the right side of the road, but I get in the car on the wrong side. <laughs> I, I I don't know I don't know why what it is about getting in the car. I always get in in the passenger side. Help me! I'm stuck! <laughs> okay, this- this is clouds. <laughs> clouds. 
Okay, let's shall we try and upload these? gonna stop in here because it'll fix the car for some reason okay is this what i have okay no this is different to this picture okay we're gonna take another yeah i don't really have a memory for maps and i think that's because i don't know how to drive it irl <laughs> I am not a driver. I don't need to drive. I live... I've only ever lived places you can walk. Uh, I'm trying to learn because I feel like I should get just get my license, but there's just so... I just can't get anyone to teach me. Um, I think... I think compared to other places, British driving tests are pretty strict. No so for me, I still have things to do. We don't have anything on our checklist, actually, Nancy. So, uh, so you pretty much have to get somebody else to teach you at least a couple of times. So what's up? Thanks why do we? Advice. Why do we have Take to thank, thank him? He doesn't give us any advice. I did my theory test last year, and it's going to run out next year. So I'll have done it for no reason because I've been trying for literally a year to get driving lessons. I've had like three people cancel on me last minute. It's so annoying. I wish I'd learned when I was younger. <laughs> I need to connect my phone first. Okay. Download. Let's download them all, I say. Is that What's good up? enough? I've harassed you enough. Take care. No harassment will ever be good enough. Okay. I'm not I'm confused about what I'm supposed to do then because he already gave me the MP3 player. I've done that. I've done that. I've done pars mice. I fixed the TV. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I think I need to call PG Crawlmeister then. Okay, I can do that.
Oh wait, no, we have to do it out here. Hmm. Can I go around the house? No. No, oh, that's where I hoovered the prairie dogs. It kind of looks like the money box I found at the farmhouse. Can I keep the money this time? Oh, it's a note. Terms are agreed. Series of CB with CC on CG from an HB at atom by something. June 2nd. Upon delivery, payment will be tendered in the amount of $550. Are those like the thingy? Those the notes on like Scott's calendar? Oh my gosh, this, this jumper kind of looks purple in the camera. Maybe my mom was right. My mom got me this jumper and she says it's purple, but I say it's brown. But in, in the cam in the light there on camera, it kind of does look purple. It drives her nuts when I say it's brown. Brown or purple, you decide. <laughs> brown or purple, let's put it in the light again. Uh, in the light, kind of a bit more purplish. Hmm. Oh, there's the prairie dogs. Okay, let's just stand in the rain. Good to hear from you. I've been watching the weather. Things look like they've been pretty rough out there. Glad to hear you made it through okay. It was pretty intense. We would have gotten some great data, but... Uh, you still got a saboteur on the loose. Well, what else is new? We do, Pa. I can't find my mouse. There it is. Can Let's you ask tell about me the other team. Mm, now that's some good detective work. You want to make sure that we're not overlooking what's going on with the other team, am I right? That's right. Now, I don't know much about Brooke, except that she's pushing hard for that number one spot. Very ambitious and very smart. A woman with that kind of talent doesn't need to sabotage her competitors, uh, but that doesn't mean that she wouldn't. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes. Okay. Purpley brown. <laughs> Fogo, you need to decide who's right, me or my mother. It looks purple when the sun's on it like that, to me. But I, I think she thinks I'm joking when I say it's brown, but I think it's brown. <laughs> Any idea why Debbie would be turning down better jobs to stay at Canute? Andy, much as I love to help you with every small detail of your... Oh, oh dear. Come on, people, that's not even ours! Uh, now, uh, what was I saying? Was I lecturing you, or were we talking? Lecturing. <laughs> All right, then, let me continue. Uh, never mind. I can't even work up a good lecture these days with this crew. What can I do for you, Andy? I've enjoyed talking to you. Call me mm. as soon as you learn anything new. Okay, we've got this tin. Debbie, I found another tin. Oh, I better get never to mind. Work. Have fun. Hey, Nancy. Whoa, never seen that look on your face before. Well, you should have, because I'm always angry to be talking to you, Frosty. 
You and Debbie are trying to get Scott fired, aren't you? Uh, what? I have no idea what you're talking about. I overheard you two talking out in the cornfield. Or should I say, conspiring. You've been selling the stuff you shoot for Scott to someone else. Pogo, who do you think it is? I, I'm honestly a bit lost a on what point. the mystery is. That's how you got all those scratches on your arm. You two are trying to get Scott so frustrated that he finally <gasps> Hi, Nancy Hanna. And says or does something that will force the college to let him I'll go. I'll let you know when Nancy shuts up. Nancy, do you have any idea how crazy you sound? What I don't know for sure is whether you two are also responsible for the I'll other I'll let you know once we've here, like confronted by enemy Frosty. And the equipment failure and the mouse infestation. I guess I'll just have to tell Scott everything and see what he thinks. Okay, look. I don't know why you feel like you need to stick your big fat nose where it doesn't belong, but all I did was sell some pictures and footage to this girl. What, what I about my nose? To make a name for herself as a nature photographer. Legally, all the stuff I shoot belongs to the team, but that's totally unfair, and Debbie agrees. She knows how hard it is to get a good start, and she looks the other way. Don't be upset with her, though. She's just trying to help. But when it comes to all that other stuff, I had nothing to do with any of it, and neither did she. I promise you. Mm. So there's really no reason to tell Scott any of this. Mm. Right? I guess not. You're a fine lady. Oh, and that big fat nose. You can't thing. take that back. <laughs> so, uh, how are those cloud pictures coming? Actually, I'm having problems. I've been nothing so but strategy. bullied by you know, this whole team. Fraser Creek Windmill. I'll bet you anything you'll get your picture. Weather conditions for Zero Stratus should be perfect right now. In the meantime, I gotta get back to work. See ya. So I played this game many years ago. Did not like it that much. I honestly put it up there with like my least favorite games. Mm, is that still the case? I don't know. It probably still would go in one of my least favorites, but I like it better. I don't like any of the characters. I really dislike Frosty, even more than Scott, probably. <laughs> At least Scott is just miserable. You know, Scott's just, yeah, he's just miserable and, you know, he, he admits it. Frosty. And Debbie, Debbie irks me this stream because I told her about the footage on Frosty's T TV and she I'm just being gaslit by everyone you didn't fix that camera if one more person tells me I didn't fix that camera I'm gonna flip <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna flip I fixed that camera Chase he's all right but he's a bit forgettable to be honest it's Frosty and Scott that's just because they're both awful Pa, Pa's a sweetie. I like What's Pa. Up? Frosty told me that he's been secretly selling his footage and that you're helping. He said that, did he? Well, that's not exactly something you need to worry about. Debbie. Debbie, please. Maybe it's something you shouldn't be involved in. Hands Nancy, on hips. I have no idea what you're talking about. Do yourself a favor and keep your mind on your work. I better get to work. Have fun. What work? Do I have to do that? Time to call it a day, Nancy. <gasps> no, I'm going to I'll bed. First thing in the morning. I'm going to bed. I'm not I'm not doing clouds. If I can just go to bed, I'm off. Good morning, Debbie. Nancy. Debbie, timing. if that is your We've real got a name. <laughs> storms ready to go critical. We need to get out in the field now. You'll drive. Scott and I are going to be tracking the storm. Uh, okay, ready? Yes. Let's I know go. that's what I said. You're not my mother, Debbie. You do not want me driving at people. I don't know the right side of the road. Two, maybe three possible targets out there. All right, good. That's what I like to hear. Where? We're looking at got word that the northmost cell is already throwing some pretty sizable hail. We might be a little Okay, on north. Well, uh, that's not the system I'm excited about anyway. Next, we go west. It's a longer drive. West? Never eat shredded wheat. Okay. Perfect. From what I've been hearing, Brooks' team has been saying they already got six confirmed touchdowns and two good reads on supercells that didn't spawn funnels. 
Six people confirming one storm cloud is not six confirmations. We really could use a nice data set on a non-tornadic supercell. Maybe she'll share what she's got. <laughs> okay, I've That's gone west. Idea. Why didn't I think of that? And I can't turn the truck around. Sure, it'd be really cool if you'd share your data. I mean, really, it's just the polite thing to do. All right, stay sharp. This system is starting to look really good. Should I drive into one of the pull-offs for tracking the storm? Yes. What about here? <laughs> I can't find a storm. Bad news. Where is it? <laughs> okay. There is nothing for miles. Is it this one? Okay, we're here. Even when it's a nice day, I want to keep an eye on the sky. Uh. Oh no, there's a truck coming. Okay. I want to go here. Where do I go? Isn't this where they want me to park? One of the places there's a cloud. Oh. Yeah, there's a cloud there. Or maybe here. We, I'll take you here. And you'll like it or lump it. Here. That's it. Just being bullied. Right, what, what, what do you want me to look at? This? No? This? Since can you could care less about providing working equipment, we're stuck with this garbage. You're going to have to take care of warming it up since it's about twice your age. You're going to have to flip three switches, one in each group, to get it started. All the lights oh, no. need to be set to blue before it starts working properly. Remember, the lights won't turn until you activate them. What? Oh, okay. So that's blue. Is that a group? That a group? What do you mean? What do you mean? <gasps> Violet, no. Hi, Violet. No, you're here to witness something bad. I don't know what's going on. What did he say? <laughs> Is it in my observations? My clues? No. Nancy just doesn't feel like writing anything down in this game. <laughs> that's that's my main issue with this game, that it doesn't really if you don't listen to what they're saying and like really take it in, you're screwed. No, blobby, leave. Like what's a group? What does he mean? I don't I don't understand what he means. He said turn the knobs one in each group. But which, what's a group? I don't There you go, they're all yellow now. I only just heard of Miss who Mr. Blobby is because of Taskmaster. Mr. Blobby haunted the nightmares. 
of every English child. Is this a group and this a group? Oh, something, it didn't happen. Okay, I don't really understand, but okay. Okay, so is it like two, 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 one, two? So then I have to press one in this group. Is that right? Do I have to press one in this even to turn it off? And then do I have to press one here? I don't want to press one here. Or can I get away with pressing one here? Okay, so this is a group, this is a group, this is a group, okay. And now I need to press one in this bit. Okay, and then if I do... Mm. Crawlmeister, okay. There it goes again. Shoot. We gotta get I kind of stumbled upon that answer, but Those that's fine. Get mixed up. It will be days before I can get them resorted. Make sure you keep those cables in order. Don't forget, the top cable goes in the first plug, and the bottom goes in the last plug. Oh no, I'm not good at stuff like this. Top cable. I think this one, because it's, it's on top of everything. What's the word? You finished? Then this. Oh, Scott! If I'm going to have to put up with Scott saying that every two seconds, I'm going to write it. I'm going to do it. Then is it yellow? Almost done. No, Scott. Surprisingly, the task you just asked me to do has not been finished. Now I think green... Can you hurry it up a little? Oh, Scott, please. Maybe orange? Almost done? Make sure you're keeping those cables in order. Try working from the top down. That blue. Now I'm thinking this. Oh, I don't know. Uh, and then Make pink. sure you're keeping those cables in order. Try working from the top down. Okay, at least it tells you. 
Smashed it. Nice job, Nancy. Looks like we're ready to roll. Actually, no like thanks to you lot. Here. Nothing's developing like it should be. Let's get back to base and track from there. I don't want to follow a bum lead on a system with this much potential. Okay, my phone just rang, so I need to BRB. I'm back. I'm back. Okay. So we're done hating Frosty. <laughs> Some more. What do Nancy, I do, Debbie? Have you seen Scott? Not since we got back. There's a huge front coming in and he's nowhere to be seen. This is not like Scott. If you see him around, will you let me know? Chase and Frosty too and busy are being to be guilty or something soon, and I really need to know that someone is keeping an eye on these fronts it's not me oh I feel like this is gonna be a real headache whatever this is to do with Still have to do that. See, like it just doesn't update your task list. Like, what's up? I've harassed I'm not going to go and take a picture of that. <laughs> I refuse. Can you see if Scott's around? Really need to talk to him now. Okay, I don't think he is though. The band's missing. Hey there. I'll check back with you later. Bye now. Do do I have to go and look for him? Has he gone out by himself? Okay, where's the where the do I need to go to this store? Where will it be? Ah! How do you stop getting stuck on these bits? <laughs> I need a car to come along and knock me out. Come on, come on, get me, get me. Help me, thank you. <laughs> Send help. Is he back here? Oh, maybe I'll see the car parked. Oh my god. 
That did a lot of damage. Oh, no, help, I'm stuck again. No, I need more help. No, I want to turn around. No, I want to turn around. I want, I've been wanting to turn around for ages. Why is it so difficult to control the car? Just kick me off the research team. I don't want to be here. Okay. Well, I see the just see the car chilling about. Chilling. Pa, is he with Pa? No, this is where I dump the mice. Uh, no, where's the other cloud? Scott, where are you? Towels, have you seen a very grumpy man? I don't really want to go there unless I, he's absolutely there because it takes ages to find your way back. Where is he? I'm, I'm googling it. I don't want to drive around looking for him. Okay, there should be a clue in his office, apparently. I was just going to look for the car. The, the, the more sensible option. Oh my god. I'm stuck. These controls, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to flip. <laughs> Why would you do this to me? Why can't it be arrow keys? Okay, there's the farm. Oh my god. Why? I swear I wasn't getting stuck like this in the first half of the game. It's just suddenly started happening. Get me. Nudge me. Yeah, there you go. Get out my way. Get out my way. I'm going this way. You can't stop me. I mean, you can stop me because <laughs> it's very annoying. It's 
Scott, you paying Scott off? Obviously. You fulfilled your end of the bargain. My team is bound to win now. Let's meet at the agreed upon location this afternoon before the storm hits. I'll bring your payment. Don't forget the final uh something terms. Uh you disappear until my team have officially been named the winner. Location site review surface charts. Forty-five plus something point in conditions. Dew point in conditions. Moderate rain. Five degrees with either light hail. Fine dates. This is the calendar thing. Do I have to do this? I don't want to. <laughs> I want to finish the game now. I'm done. I've had enough. Okay, yeah, there's no way I would have been able to do this. This sounds so complicated. doing this. I'm out. I'm done. Is that it? These symbols match Scott's. This must be some sort of code. Okay. Sorry about that. So where do I go? I, I've completely forgotten everything now because of that. Mm. It's all my terrible pictures. Oh, the windmill. Is he at the windmill? So does this one. Hmm. These are all of the windmill. That must be where Scott's been meeting Brooke. OK. 
Okay. Where's that other car gone? Now I have to go in the flimsy car? Now I'm in the flimsy car? Where's the windmill? Okay, this one is easier to turn. Okay, maybe that's where I've been going wrong this whole time. This one actually turns in the road. I wanted to take the more robust cars so that I didn't crash them. Nancy, what are you doing here? You mean you, the me jigs up as opposed to Brooke? <laughs> Brooke? What are you talking about? When I was fixing the phone jack, I accidentally overheard the phone conversation you two had. I could hear it through the headset on your desk. And just what do you think you overheard? Enough to know you two are working together. You've been sabotaging your own team, haven't you? You've been doing everything you can to make sure Brooke's team wins and yours loses. That's ridiculous. That's why you're meeting her way out here. His posture is terrible. Up to you all this time, and that's coming from me. <laughs> paying you off. I have never gotten the credit I deserve for the work I've done, ever. I know more about tornadoes than any person alive, and I get neither the respect nor the compensation people half as brilliant as me get without lifting a finger. Why? Because I work for a podunk college run by podunk incompetence bent on badmouthing and spiting me at every turn just because I don't play well with others at their idiotic staff meetings. Why don't you just quit? Because thanks to them, I'm considered impossible to work with. No other school will hire me. I'm stuck here and they know it. So yes, I've been sabotaging my own team. And yes, Brooke is paying me a small fortune to do so because I've had it. I'm through. I thought he was going to hit us then. I can feel it. It'll be on the ground in minutes. And it's going to be huge. And here you are, a novice out in the field and all alone. Ah! Oh, he did hit us. Debbie calling for Nancy. Please come in. Over. Debbie, help. <laughs> Scott's a weirdo. I'm here. I think Scott knocked me out. Did what? <laughs> Imagine being Debbie and not knowing any of this. I can't believe he would do that. And with Brooke Tavanaugh of all people. Well, we'll deal with that later. Right now, I need you down here at the Grange ASAP. We need to evacuate the theater, and you've got my Grange keys with you in Frosty's car. I'm on my way. Over and out. Where is the Grange? Okay, that it's all the way over there. Okay. Is this the right way? I should have been driving Frosty's car the whole time. Oh, this is cute. It's been chaos here. I was able to cobble together a pretty basic tracking system back at the homestead and instantly I knew we were in trouble. The storm was showing a high potential of moving into town, but without the proper readings, we couldn't issue an alert. I knew we'd have to evacuate the Grange in person. But when we got here, we saw that it's locked. The shelter is locked on a performance night. I need you to take care of this while the rest of us work on a backup plan, okay? I'm trusting you here. I know you can do this. There are a lot of people depending on you right now. Uh-oh. What is this now? Who would double lock a storm shelter? Nancy, quick, which key opens the shelter? Okay, well that's a lot quicker than I was expecting. Okay. What is this now? Who would double lock a storm shelter? Nancy, quick, which key opens the shelter? What is happening? I've got no time. Do I have to get the key right first time? What is this now? Who would do 
Apple lock a storm shelter. Nancy, quick, which key opens the shelter? I'm trying, Debbie. Yes, you did it. Okay. Good job, Nancy. That was not it. <laughs> well, I think the worst has passed. Nancy, where are you going? Get in the shelter. The I worst has passed, Debbie. <laughs> the worst has passed. It's okay, fine. First thing, switch on your GPS. That little dot you see, follow that and it will lead you right to Scott. We put a tracker on his truck. It's a safety thing. But Nancy, be careful out there. Keep this radio on and I'll do my best to keep you safe. Nancy, I'm really sorry about everything that happened back there. Scott, he, he wasn't always like this. I mean, I was worried about him earlier. His heart clearly wasn't in it anymore. He was putting us in danger. I just wanted to do what's best. That's not what it sounded like when I overheard you talking to Frosty. You two wanted to get rid of- Scott. Tell her, Nancy. Rip, Debbie. Scared. You sure didn't sound very concerned about safety. Nancy, I know it probably sounded bad, but there's a lot you don't know. Pete, the intern you took over for, his injury wasn't just an accident. He got hurt because Scott sent him out where he never should have been. After that, I knew I had to take over. That's still no... Looking back, I do things differently. But I did what I did for the right reason. I wanted to push Scott... <sighs> I'm, I'm going to have to save after this, because imagine if I fail mistake, and I have to listen to this all over again. No matter what happens out there, promise me that you'll be careful. The Debbie I Redemption arc. Okay. The Debbie Redemption arc that never quite made it. Okay. Uh, okay, so I'm, I'm- oh! Oh, there's a tree in the way! No, I don't need more obstacles. I do not need this. There he is! Come on, Nancy! Oh my god. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> this is not any of the ways that I want to go. Oh wait, no, he's now, now he's this way. Oh no. No. I think, are we doing a little dance around this together? There he is! <laughs> that was awful! <laughs> Ooh, look at this! A Nancy Drew high-speed chase! successfully evacuated, Debbie okay. and Chase were able to follow the GPS tracking signal to the spring house, where Scott and I had safely weathered the storm. Although he was pretty seriously shaken up in the crash, Scott came to in time to see Frosty arrive with the police. He received community service for destruction of public property and interfering with public safety records. He didn't fare so well with a the college. They fired him quicker than lightning hitting a beast or greyhound, as they say around here. So it looks like he'll actually be serving the community now, instead of just pretending to. Even if it's just by picking up garbage by the side of the road. Word spread quickly about Scott's misdeeds, and soon Brooke Tavanaugh, the rival chase team leader, found herself out of a job as well. With the storm season almost over, it looked like both teams were out of the competition. Debbie, always the organizer, decided to I mean that looks better, but no. Both teams for the remainder of the season. 
not Debbie. The mascot's ever-present storm no. cloud hanging over the team, and his constant sabotaging, the team really began to hit its stride with Debbie Wasn't Debbie sabotaging too? Two days what? after I told Krollmeister I had found the source of the sabotage and the change in team leaders, Debbie's chase team was greeted by a surprise They were all delivery. doing a bit of sabotaging. The next generation of <laughs> storm tracking and detection equipment. With Scott out of the picture, Preston I'm pretty sure Debbie was the mice. Contract. I have no idea Scott why, just because she was a, a mouse denier. Side, he's just about doubled his output. He's launched his own business, and when he's not getting pelted by softball-sized hail, you'll find him in his studio. Chase has given up on his dreams of finding oil. Even if he hadn't, he wouldn't have the time to look. Debbie's keeping him too busy. Free from having to spend his days fixing Scott's mistakes, Chase has finally had the opportunity to show off his keen sense for weather. Now that Debbie has accepted Scott's old position as head of That's the nice. storm team, he's Chase was my favorite. Man. Oh wait, no, Pa. Probably Pa. going to assist Debbie in her classes in the fall. And when I got home, I found a surprise delivery myself as well. What about Pa? Shipment of my lifetime supply of Coco Kringle bars. Crowmeister also sent me a note telling me to keep my bags packed. He has a special surprise trip planned for me as a way to say thanks. As long as it's some place where the clouds stay in the sky like they belong, I'll be happy to go. While the winners of the Green Skies event won't be determined until fall, things are looking pretty good for Debbie's team. With the new equipment, they've logged the most storm data. And although Debbie won't be showing anyone until she's 100% sure, the team may have made a verified touchdown prediction. Yesterday, a postcard from Pa arrived. After Yay! the time repaired the storm damage to the Grange, they restaged the town play. They even added a new part about the storm, including a scene where a certain someone unlocks the storm shelter. As long as it wasn't played by a pot, <gasps> I'm famous. I'm yet. Oklahoma famous. He, that he remembered most of his lines this time, at least the important ones. <laughs> As for me, Good old pa. Well, I've had just about enough stormy weather for one season. Love, Nancy. What is the name of Canute? Oh, Harrison J. Bison. Yes. <laughs> okay, big spender. I didn't spend a lot of par pennies. I was a par penny hoarder. Candy dispenser. Couch. Oh, I didn't give anyone candy because I didn't like anyone. Couch potato. Watching TV instead of sleeping. Didn't find an Easter egg. Homesteader claiming, taking claim to your lands. Quiz whiz. <laughs> I did not ace the quiz. Storm spotter for tracking down all the clouds. Nope. Super sleuth. Nope. <laughs> Sweet tooth. Nope. But I did get the trivia right. Thank goodness. After risking my life chasing We're down playing this one next. I think it's time for a change. Tomorrow. Of I've decided to join Bess and George on their trip to Kyoto, Japan. I've always wanted to visit Japan. From the exotic food and wild fashion in the cities to the nature and tradition in the smaller towns, I know there's going to be a ton to see and do. As a thank you for all of my hard detective work, P.G. Krollmeister has reserved a room for me at one of the area's best ryokans, or traditional inns. It'll be nice to finally take a break from solving mysteries and this one's spooky. without danger and dark secrets hiding around every corner. I've already heard that the ryokan I'm staying in has quite a reputation. I'm not sure exactly for what, though. Well, I'll find that out soon enough. Spook. Join me in my next adventure, Shadow at the Water's Edge. Next. Tomorrow. Oh, is it all the pictures I took? Okay, I liked that one more than the first time I played it, but I still think they fumbled that last hour. That last hour was a bit of a drag. Hmm. But the rest. I liked the puzzles, mostly. It was just that last one. I don't think I would have got it. <laughs> anyway, so. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Might as well end there for today then. Which is sad, but I want to start Shadow at Water's Edge like fresh. Fresh. Fresh as can be. Let's get that ready now. Uh, store, library, home. Trailer the Twister uninstall. Um, this one's exciting because we've got nonograms, we've got Sudoku, we've got the other puzzle that <laughs> I can't remember the name of right now. Um, we have dodgy, 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 dodgy accents. Like, just unbelievable. Well, we'll just put up with it. Okay, thank you for watching. I will see you tomorrow for more Nancy Drew. Bye!